Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I'll be doing another watch which has been a year long with me. I did a review of it before but uh, I just wanted to share with you a one year experience how it was and how I feel about this watch on my wrist and many of you must be having it, owning it and having a charm of it. It's a very good watch to have and very low budget watch which is unexpectable to many eyes in the world. I mean, watch lovers do know it but a normal person in the life, maybe, I don't think so. And it's a really a compli compliment getter. I, whenever I wear it, people appreciate this watch while I'm wearing it and uh, I just wanted to do another review with you guys of this watch. It's a Tissot, as you can see, PRX, Powermatic 80, a very successful model from Tissot and very demanding. And they have introduced three colors in this, this watch, white, black, and this one is blue, which I think is the perfect match. And uh, I'll be doing a review of this uh, experience of one year and share it with you guys so yeah guys let's move on and talk about this watch how it is and what it looks like after one year so here it is guys this is the Tessot Powermatic 80 PRX in blue dial very outstanding watch the reason of buying this watch was just because i'm a very much a uh, lover of ap royal oak and this is the similar kind of a thing as royal oak is quite above the power of my wallet so i thought why not start with this watch and let's see what happens to have a juice of it a little bit by the dial and everything it carries just like the Royal Oak and quite similar but not that similar though but this watch is a very excellent piece and very appreciable uh, amongst the gatherings and can be wear casually as well and formally wherever you want it's in stainless steel body and uh, the bracelet is stainless steel as well and we brush finish from most of the parts and the bezel is polished finish so as you can see it's all polished finish from here and really looks amazing i really like the curves on it and fits quite accurately on the body talking about the bracelet i mean it is as well a very gives a very good look while you are wearing it i mean the shine of it is quite amazing on the bracelet though it's a brush finish i really love this brush finish shine and the stainless steel works out really well in it so yeah and it has a, a interchangeable buckle butterfly claps with push button as you can see it can be just go on push button and it's a butterfly claps and with a tessot logo over here and yeah very good watch to have in the collection it's a beginner and a very affordable watch with a very good quality i'll say i mean tessot has nailed it i mean they are doing the work from ages i mean they are they are one of the oldest brands in swiss making i mean swiss uh, watch making and they come out with some really good ideas and qualities of watch which are really amazing and this is one of their example of the newest ones and i've wanted to show you and talking about the dial i mean it has uh, all silver markings on the r ones and the second arm is all silver as well and the minute arm and blue arm, uh, minute arm and the our arm are loomed and the 12 o'clock is loomed as well rest i don't think so i never used it at night so 
only 12 o'clock and the R arm and the minute uh, arm are the looms and on 3 o'clock you can see there is a date and the dial is in dark blue color which changes the shades according to the light and with Tissot on 12 o'clock and then on 6 o'clock PRX Promatic as you can see over here and talking about the crown it's a non-screwable crown so it's open so you can just screw it like that and you can put some juice in it and it will be uh, winded and it's automatically winds as well so uh, not a big deal but you have to wind it before you have and one push changes the date and the other push you can change the time and set the time according to it so yeah and the bezel over here is quite smooth and curved and looks really amazing with the glass which is all sapphire crystal and shines very perfectly fine as you can see and the quality of it is really good and amazing to see it in the daylight it looks really amazing on the wrist so and it has a power resistance of uh, sorry water resistance of uh, 100 meters and the power reserve is round about uh, the movement I will, I'll say is uh, the movement is Promatic 80.11 and the frequency of this watch is uh, 21600 BPH and 3 hertz and carries 23 joules in it so it's a very good watch and a little heavy as well not that heavy but little heavy talking about the size of the dial the uh, it's 40 millimeter by the thickness is 11 millimeters so it's a very reasonable size and looks really amazing though while you're looking at it it doesn't look that big actually but uh, the dial doesn't look big but the sides including the sides it makes it round about 40 millimeters so it's a very uh, reasonable size and fits very well on the uh, almost on every wrist probably and talking about the case at the back it's a see-through case and you can see the function over there I mean all the movement is right there in front of you which is a very good thing and I really like the see-through ones and it's also a uh, sapphire crystal and uh, very and the sides are all polished and neat and clean yeah let me show you I mean on my wrist so you can see it comes out really nice looks really perfect on the wrist and you can see the bracelet it merges very nice and the shine of it is quite perfect and comes out really nice on the wrist sorry about the glass it's a little my hands prints are all, all over it Actually, I collect watches very, I mean, I don't see at the price, I look at the quality and this is one of the best things which are providable in a very reasonable price and uh, all my watches are totally, almost not identical or same brands. I like variety in it, I mean, I like the variety, what you get, what you are getting, something always different, some new brands I like to test and this is how I collect my watches and I prefer not changing them but somehow when you buy a big budget watch you have to but small budget watch you know I mean they don't give you so much so you have to keep them one of the example I mean this is resale I mean you can resell it I mean there are buyers for this watch but you will not get a good price on it 
probably i don't think so uh, because it is it is available in the uh, with the ads and with in different shops as well of uh, different i mean brand shops and tesort shop as well i mean they are available and yeah but uh, this is all the the per i mean i bought this watch just because as i mentioned before i'm a very big fan of ap and uh, royal oak so that is quite way up in the price so i just wanted to i saw this watch and this was a bit kind of a similar to it so i don't why not go for it and uh, one more watch i'm looking for is zenith uh, uh, that is on the next list i mean hit list actually i'll say it's on the hit list and i'm really much interested in the five skeleton classic self skeleton and let's see what happens i'm looking for it and if i can get one they have uh discontinued that model but uh, let's see what happens maybe i'm lucky i can buy it from a uh pre-owned or something like that but talking about this watch this is an amazing watch and uh, if you don't have it i mean it's a good piece to collect and it's been one year and i love this watch every time i wear it and i wear it wear it a lot i mean quite much i have wear it wore it i mean uh most of the year i wore it i mean like i bought it last year september i think and it's december now and i wore i've wore it quite a lot many times and it's still in the perfect shape and really enjoying this watch and the main reason is if you enjoy the watch that's the main target i mean you have to enjoy the watch you bought and this is something i am really enjoying and love to wear it every day at work at anywhere i mean functions or anything i really work on i mean love with this watch the shape and the cuts the way the bracelets are mer merging with the case everything is amazing on this watch to look the shine the dial of course the main purpose of buying this watch was the dial the blue dial with the texture in it just like the ap royal oak so that was the main object to which attract me towards buying this watch and even the shape dial shape as well the bracelet shape everything is perfect so yeah and they have uh, uh recently they have introduced a new color in the PRX uh, quartz model which is tiffany blue i suppose the tiffany color and that looks really amazing and uh, i will have a look on that watch as well that is worth buying as well but that is on the plain dial plain tiffany blue uh, tiffany color maybe in future they give this texture as well in tiffany maybe i don't know in quartz so let's see if they do that will be a great thing i mean i would really love to buy that in the same dial structure dial which is really amazing and it gives two tone color which is quite good yeah so yeah guys this is tesod prx promatic 80 hope you have enjoyed it and uh, enjoyed the video and please do subscribe to my channel really means a lot to me and 